we can talk about it later on in the video so stick around to the end to find out those details that you might have missed when watching this trailer let's press play let's jump in right so right now we have a mad max setting some skins that i recognize dirt bikes of course i'll also at the end of the video pause and uh, jump in there's some back blings as well that you might notice at the end of the video, I'll pause and I'll do a slight breakdown of things that I've noticed. Okay. What do we have here? <laughs> I like that. It's definitely, apparently, a Mad Max themed season. Megalodon. <laughs> I have a skin very similar. You can also have a look at that skin as well. I know that downtime is really soon. Ringmaster Scar. You can see a uh, P-Boy. I like P-Boy. Maybe a Fantapili. Wrecked. The Machinist. Rust. I'm actually going to pull out my headset so you can't hear that music there. Just to make sure that we can share that. There's a new grapple hook mechanic that you just noticed. Dirt bikes. Were there new stunts on the dirt bikes? I'm not sure. This looks like an emote. He puts, some, he puts the cap in his pocket. Did he put the cap in his pocket? Ooh, look at the gun on top of the car. The battle bus has been tricked out. Okay, there's a few different things here. Looking good, looking good. Ray Wastelander Magneto, so Magneto's abilities are also available. Bright Bomber is back with a different style. You can see as well the uh, landscape has completely changed. Fortnite Wrecked, Chapter 5, Season 3. Right, so now that we've watched the trailer, no time for my breakdown of different things that I saw in the trailer to give you those all important details of what might be coming to Chapter 5, Season 3. Let's jump in to those details. So as you already know, this huge cloud is now consuming the Fortnite island. It was looming at the end of the season, chapter five, season two, and it is now finally covering the island and has revealed these new skins that are on the way. Let's have a look. Now, as you know, Jonesy normally makes an appearance at some point during the trailers or in the theme or story of Fortnite. Right here, this skin might not actually be Jonesy because you can't see his face. <laughs> so that's something to point out because there is a mullet Jonesy. Mullet Jonesy is blonde. This skin is not blonde. So it looks like it has the facial features of Jonesy, but it might actually be a completely new skin and character. There is also a smoothie that this character is drinking, which I assume is going to be a bat bling. We've had smoothie bat blings before, and you can see some of those that I've used in my Fortnite gameplay. Right there, you can see a fish stick smoothie. <laughs> this ship, I assume, is going to be a POI that is going to be available in the game. So I'm going to be looking out for that and go to the coast of the island to see if it's available. And you can maybe climb inside it, get some items and chests or something. Maybe there's a boss in that ship. So I'll have a look out for that as well. As you know, you have your exclusive Battle Pass skins. In this case, this I believe is going to be a Battle Pass skin because it's been advertised in the trailer. So normally when skins are being advertised in the trailer like this, normally a part of the Battle Pass. Megalodon is the one right here. We have a skin similar, but now he has his sort of Mad Max look on him. One detail that you might miss is when it's showcasing Ringmaster Scar, another skin that would be available in the game. She also has a crossbow weapon. So this crossbow weapon, of course, might be available in this season of Fortnite. Whether it's going to be available at the beginning of the season is something that we'll be able to see later on today. There's another character looking very G.I. Joe like with the gun in the air. That character might also be a skin available in the game later on so we keep an eye out for that as well. Now a skin that I'm very excited for that you can see below me it's called Peabody. Now Peabody reminds me of Peely. I think this is going to be a very popular skin. If it's available in the battle pass that'd be cool but of course this skin looks really good so I think that's a really well done skin right there Peabody. I'll try to get this skin if I can. But you can see him right there looking good. I'm excited for Peabody. It's clear that modding is going to be something that this season is going to lean into. These new trucks, these 4x4s have been modded. And you can see the front grille there is literally teeth. A monster truck. So you can see that it has like a teeth sort of grille at the front of those cars there. Whether it's going to give the car a new ability... I don't know, but we can't see any new abilities being used in these cars right now. There's also a modded battle bus in the background there as well. So the battle bus has been modded with this sort of Mad Max feel. So Mad Max Furiosa is sort of the theme that is in this season of Fortnite. So whether there's going to be Mad Max Furiosa skins coming later on as well, we're not sure, but it definitely looks like it. When this skin here is being showcased, Rust, you can see quite a few things happening in the background. There are new emotes along with Rust being showcased. So Rust is a new skin right here, but there are also new emotes that you can see all of these skins 
using. So have a look in the earlier part of this video to see those emotes in action. There's also a new POI behind, including the Nitrodrome. So what the Nitrodrome is like inside, I'm not sure, but it looks very bright, which is gonna be brilliant for those next gen gamers because you're going to see a lot of those ray tracing and things in the game, which is like, yo, makes Fortnite even better, doesn't it? If you look closely at this shot, and when you rewatch this video, you will notice that the vehicle which is pulling Peabody along actually has some sort of flame wheels going on. It looks like it's being modded in some way. So maybe you can actually mod the vehicles to have some sort of flame ability to make them move faster maybe. And I'll look at something else right now to give you the confirmation that this is definitely a thing in this season. In this part of the trailer, you can see this skin using something that splashes in a radius covering not only himself, but also what looks like his squad mate, which has a new skin as well. So the two new skins hidden right here in this frame. So that looks like a modded slap juice that would be available, which would be really cool to have a look at. So I'm looking for my win today. Of course, you know I'm gonna be uploading my win. Don't forget to check that out as well. And we also have the T60 power armor, and it looks like there are different versions of this skin. This shot is clearly very important. In the background there, you can see that POI that I mentioned beforehand. So that ship is potentially going to be a POI in this season of Fortnite. The reason why I say that is because if you look on top of the ship, you can see it's withered and there were quite a few things on top of the ship there that previously was not on top of the ship from what you can see in the trailer. So it's going to be potentially a POI that you can at least get on top of. The grapple hook is being hooked onto a vehicle. This armor actually sprays what looks like oil in his face. Now I think that's literally an emote. There's also clearly a new car body that is going to be available in rocket racing and of course battle royale. And you can see that car body right now. So you're going to have a monster truck looking vehicle. It actually has a weapon on top of it. So whether that's going to be something that's gonna be available all the time for that vehicle, I don't know, but you can see there's literally a weapon on top of that car. So when you're driving it, are you gonna be able to shoot as well? This season's got quite a lot of modifications to the cars. So let's see what happens with our weapons as well. So there's gonna be some mods to the weapons. Now we've had a battle bus available on the map beforehand. It was quite fun to use because it just absolutely destroys things. It wrecks things. This modded battle bus looks like it'll also be available. So I can't wait to use it to see what different things are available on that battle bus. Because when you're playing games like squads, people can jump onto the battle bus and get onto the back of it and stuff like that as well. So we'll have a look out to see what happens with the battle bus because that'd be quite cool for squads I think that's definitely a squads thing but wrecking things in that battle bus as well <laughs> it's quite fun to use <laughs> Wastelander Magneto, also a skin that's going to be available in this season of Fortnite as you can see I feel like this may be a tier 100 skin the Magneto ability at this point looks like it might be a mythic that has two capabilities shielding so you can shield yourself from the front doesn't look like it's going to be a 360 radius and of course that all-important attack it looks like you can use this ability five times before it may need to reload because there were five dots locking things on screen while you're aiming with this mythic Magneto ability. And if you look right beneath me, you can see that there is a petrol station, but one of the vehicles have been modded. So there's a sports car that has been modded to have bigger wheels. So whether you can modify your vehicles right now with those tires like you could before in different seasons is something that we can also look out for because this season of Fortnite doesn't look like it's going to be completely flat. Looks like there's going to be quite a few hills. And one of the struggles of the season just gone is trying to get up hills in a vehicle. So having those tires that you can mod your car with again in this season, definitely going to be something that would definitely help out players when trying to get up really big hills. Bright Radar, also a new skin that's available in the season of Fortnite. Looks like it's gonna be quite a cool skin, definitely one for the Fortnite OG fans. And what I assume is gonna be the center of the map, there's this party looking disco-like POI that you can see right here. Definitely gonna be one that's gonna attract a load of loopers and players too, because you wanna see that flashing lights, that colorful imagery, all that like party pandemonium going on in Fortnite. So that looks like it's gonna be the center of the map. And that's my breakdown of this trailer for Fortnite Chapter 5 Season 3. If you've enjoyed it, don't forget to give me that thumbs up, follow me, subscribe and all that good stuff. Thank you for watching.